Now, Cap Cave View First Alert Weather with Jason Valentine. Good Wednesday evening, everyone. We have made it to midweek, and my goodness, what a day we had today. Plenty of sunshine and plenty of heat as well. Hottest day of 2023. We did get to the 90 degree range. We thought that could be possible in the Tri-Cities area. We do have some stray showers. We saw one coming through the Walla Walla area, but that has moved on, and we have that rain, wind, and cooler conditions coming Friday, and really they're going to start Thursday evening. So, folks, a lot going on. So, in our Skywatch radar, we saw that quick little flash come through Walla Walla, and it was just a little bit at the Dayton area. Other than that, we're looking very dry, and again, we could just see a quick little shower or two come through. Now, our big picture, this is what we're looking at tomorrow. I'll get to overnight in just a second. We have a low pressure system in the southern part of California, really the middle part of California. As we move on into our afternoon, Afternoon. We're going to start to see some more shower activity start to form in our area and then it's going to be pushing in from that low pressure system. But at the same time tomorrow night, we're getting some influence in from the Gulf of Alaska and that is going to cool us down. So we're just going to see those showers come through still warm enough to not be snow, but rain showers uh, very heavy in the evening and then slowing down as we're cooling down into Friday. So folks, a lot going on. So in our future cast, here's what we're looking at as we get into our evening hours again possibility of some quick little showerlets coming through so don't be surprised if you see a little bit of showers as we move into the rest of our Thursday uh, looking better in the morning hours but my goodness we're going to get hit by quite a lot of shower activity some thunderstorms could be a part of this so do be prepared for a little bit of that and as we move on into our evening hours look at this widespread even some very heavy cells in places this could be our heaviest rain for some time and as we move into the evening hours it's going to start to settle down a bit into our morning still a little bit more of the light rain variety and maybe a little heavier in the blue mountain region but still sticking around on our friday as we get into our saturday and sunday things should be settling down but heavy rain could be heavy thunderstorms starting tomorrow night and then slowing down to much lighter rain, but still pretty consistent for your Friday. Look at these current conditions. 90 degrees in the Tri-Cities. Cool spot, 81 for Pendleton, 83 for uh, Ellensburg. But folks, mid to upper 80s for the rest of our areas. Just a warm, warm day. And then we're going to be cooling down as we head into uh, our Thursday and down into our Friday. Again, folks, we saw 90 today in the Tri-Cities. We could see 60 on Friday. That is a 30 degree drop. That is very rare, and it makes sense that we're seeing the thunderstorms come in with that kind of meeting of the low pressure system down in California and what's going on in Alaska. So, folks, we're going to see quite the event uh, tomorrow night into Friday. So, light winds right now. We do expect winds to be picking up again for our Friday, kind of our main event. We are going to be looking at 15 to 25 mile per hour winds then we'll slow down a bit into our weekend but still pretty uh, breezy conditions as we head into our next work week. So a little bit of wind tomorrow and then it'll really kick up, especially tomorrow night into Friday morning. Overnight tonight, we are staying warm mid to upper 50s for our overnight lows, partly cloudy skies. As we head into our Thursday, again, it's going to start very nice. We're going to see sunshine in the morning hours, uh, lower 80s, mid to upper 70s. But again, temperatures all over the place as we start to get very uh, unsettled for our weather pattern. And that's going to be very uh, prevalent as we get to Friday. So Friday, 60 degrees in the Tri-Cities. We're at 90 right now. That is a big, big drop. Then as we head into our weekend, we'll be in the upper 60s. Going to take a while to warm back up, folks, so hope you're able to enjoy today. Yakima, we're in the mid 80s, so about a 25 degree drop into Friday and then mid 60s into your weekend. Much better conditions, though, into your weekend. So, folks, a hot one today. Enjoy your evening. Less hot tomorrow, but those big changes coming tomorrow night into Friday.